Let us see the next examples. Here the problems over train and the flight. That is, if the speed has been increased is the one case and the speed has been decreased in another case. If the speed is increased, the time will be the less. And if the speed is decreased, the time will be the more. Now, let us see the first example. A train covers a distance of 90 kilometers at a uniform speed. If the speed had been 15, kilo, 15 kilometers per hour more, it would have taken 30 minutes less for the journey. Find original speed of train. Now, let us see the first one. Let original speed of train is equal to x kilometers per hour. Let us suppose. Now, distance to move d is equal to distance d is equal to how much distance it has to travel 90 kilometers now time taken to go to the destination that is time is represented with the t that is time is equal to distance by speed that is distance is 90 kilometers by speed of the train is x kmph this is equation 1 after that if the speed has been 15 kilometers per hour more that means the speed has been increased that is speed has been increased by 15 kilometers per hour that means speed is increased now new speed new speed of train is equal to previously it is a x now it is a 15 x plus 15 kilometers per hour now the distance is the same distance distance d is equal to same distance that is a 90 kilometers only now what is the time taken time t is equal to distance by speed that is 90 by x plus 15 this is equation 2 now from the question the, now from data speed has been increased because of increasing the speed i save the time 30 minutes for my journey therefore speed has been increased therefore from the data 90 by x minus 90 by x plus 15 is equal to how much time i saved 30 minutes that is it is in terms of minutes that's why i had to write 30 by 60 why because my standard measurements are kilometers per hour that's why we have to convert into hours now here take 90 common 1 by x minus 1 by x plus 15 is equal to this is 1 by 2 in the next step do the LCM of this one x into x plus 15 x x get cancel x plus 15 minus x plus 15 x plus 15 get cancel x is equal to this 90 will be cross multiplied to other side that is 1 by 2 into 90 now next step that is plus x minus x get cancelled now 
15 by x into x plus 15 equal to 1 by 180. That is cross multiply x into x plus 15 is equal to 15 into 180. That is x square plus 15x. This is a plus value bring inside. There is a minus 15 eighteens. That is doing the margin work. 15 eighteens. That is Two hundred seventy. That is two seventy and one more zero. That is two thousand seven hundred. Now x square plus fifteen x minus two thousand seven hundred is equal to zero. This is a quadratic equation. Now we have to simplify this one. That is x square plus. Find out the factors for two thousand seven hundred. After subtraction, we must get fifteen. Therefore, factors are 60, 45, 2700 is equal to 0. That is, take x common, x plus 60 minus take 45 common, x plus 60 is equal to 0. That is, x plus 60 is common factor and x minus 45 is equal to 0 is a other factor. Now, therefore, x plus 60 is equal to 0, comma, x minus 45 is equal to 0. That is, x is equal to minus 60 and x is equal to 45. From the both the values, 60 is the negative value and 45 is the positive value. Therefore, we cannot mention speed in terms of the negative. Therefore, speed of train is equal to 45 kilometers per hour. Next, similarly, come to the second question. Option B. In the flight of 300 kilometers, an aircraft was slowed down. Slowed down means speed has been decreased due to the bad weather. The speed was reduced. How much it is reduced? 10 kilometers per hour it is reduced. Then the journey would have taken one hour longer. Why it is the journey is longer? Because it is a slowed down. Because it is slowed. Find the average speed of the flight and the duration also. Okay, let speed of flight is equal to average speed is equal to x k m p h. That is, after that, distance to move, distance d is equal to how much distance I had the flight has to move 300 kilometers. Now, time taken to go to the destination, that is, time taken to go to the destination, time is equal to distance by speed, that is, 300 by x, this is equation 1. After that, what happened? Aircraft was slowed down, that is, the speed has been decreased. Speed had been decreased. By how much is it, how much it is decreased? Ten kilometers per hour it is decreased. The speed has been decreased by ten kilometers per hour. Okay, then now what is the new speed? Therefore, new speed of flight is equal to x minus ten. Why? Because speed has been decreased. Now the distance, 
distance d is equal to the same distance it has to move that is uh, 300 kilometers it has to move now how much time it will take that is the distance by speed 300 by speed how much speed new speed is x minus 10 this is equation 2 now from data from data let us see 10 kilometers speed is decreased then what is happened the journey would have taken one hour longer that means the speed is decreased means the time will increase therefore from data 300 by x minus 10 by 300 by x is equal to 1 what is this one one hour now take 300 common 1 by x minus 10 minus 1 by x is equal to 1 now that is next step that is 1 by x minus 10 minus 1 by x is equal to 1 by 300 that is do the LCM part x into x minus 10 x minus 10 x minus 10 cancel x minus bracket starts x x get cancel x minus 10 is equal to 1 by 300 in the numerator open the brackets x minus x plus 10 by x square minus 10 x is equal to 1 by 300 that is plus x minus x get cancelled after next to the cross multiplication x square minus 10 is equal to 300 into 10 that is x square minus 10x minus 3000 is equal to 0 that is x square minus 10x minus 3000 is equal to 0 that is you have to find out the factors of 3000 whose subtraction will give you 10 that is x square minus 60x plus 50x minus 3000 is equal to 0 because 60 50s are 3000 60 minus 50 is the 10 that is take x common x minus 61 factor 50 x minus 60 is equal to 0 x minus 60 is the common factor and x plus 50 is the other factor therefore x minus 60 is equal to 0 x plus 50 is equal to 0 that is x is equal to 60 and x is equal to minus 50 from these two values 60 is a positive one 50 is a negative one S speed cannot be mentioned in terms of negative answer therefore speed of flight speed of flight is equal to 60 kmph kilometer per hour and one more thing is also asked what is the duration that is duration is equal to duration nothing but time that is 300 by duration of the flight in the first case time distance by speed what is the speed now 60 0 0 get cancelled that is 5 hours therefore duration of the flight is 5 hours if you like this video please give a thumbs up please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on cbsc syllabus